hold up. You mean to tell me that we're really down this bad to where people are over analyzing that five second clip of Lamar Jackson throwing a Sammy Watkins? Don't get mad. Uh -huh. It's just what it is. It's what it is. Yeah, we talking sports shot out in Graven Vance. Yeah, this feels like a dream. So, YouTube team, keep it clean. What's going on? It's Engraven here with another video. And in this video, we are here to talk about something that we weren't scheduled to talk about. We had another video that was going to drop, but after seeing the Pat McAfee show yesterday, after seeing so many comments on YouTube yesterday, after seeing so many comments on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, all of that stuff about this, this five second clip, we got to try to bring everybody back down to earth because it seems as if we are just into we're not even into the slowest part of the off season yet we're not even there yet i told y'all we on the way but we're not even there yet for people to really take that five second clip and over analyze it a five a five a five second clip it's like really but before we get into this man tell somebody you love them for real because people need to hear that tell somebody you love them and tell somebody that they are doing a great job Please tell them that they're doing a great job because not enough people hear that. And that reminds me of this situation that we're getting ready to talk about because we've been saying this ever since 2018. No matter what Lamar Jackson does, no matter what Lamar Jackson accomplishes, no matter what obstacles he overcomes, no matter what, it's going to be people who is not good enough for. It's always going to be people who is not good enough for. And it's always going to be people sitting back, waiting, sitting back behind the bushes, sitting at the top of the bleachers, looking down, looking in the stadium, reading every article, watching every video, looking at every clip and being like, huh, Lamar Jackson, I don't like him. So let me try to find something. Let me try to find something that's wrong with what he did, even though it could be something right. But let me try to find something because I am consistently waiting for him to fail. It's so many people like that. So yesterday, well, I think the Ravens put out the clip either yesterday or two days ago. They put out the clip that we showed at the end of the intro of Lamar Jackson throwing a pass to Sammy Watkins in OTAs. OTAs. See, that's the thing. We're not even in mini camp. We're not even in training camp yet. OTAs. Him throwing one single pass. In OTAs. And people are like, oh man, Lamar Jackson. Wow, what a terrible pass. Well, that, that pass was so wobbly. Oh my goodness, it was so bad. One single pass. And people are really going in. I watched the uh the Pat McAfee show, which is a show I really enjoy. When I do watch it, I don't watch it as much as I used to, but I still catch it here and there. But they had a whole segment on this one pass and the point of this video is not even to talk about that one pass but to continue to remind you that stuff like this is not going away for Lamar Jackson it's not we and we we know it we've been saying this ever since he came on the scene it's not going it's never going to go away it's always going to be people looking for every little mistake that he makes even the, again was the pass dropped no was the pass intercepted no it was a completion. It was a completion. Now, I, I've seen it myself plenty of times in throughout different games. I mean, even this past season, but certainly the past two, it's, it's always something. If Lamar does this, people will say, oh, well, he didn't do that. If Lamar does that, well, people will say, oh, well, he didn't do this. And I'm not here saying that Lamar Jackson is this perfect quarterback because he's not. He still got things he got to work on. He still got things he got to improve on. But to sit up here, <laughs> to sit here and to, for people to really go in on, <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> for people to sit here and really go in on a five second clip of a, an OTA completion. See? It all depends on how you look at it. What side of the spectrum you're looking at it from. 
Because when I first saw the clip, I didn't think anything of it. I said, okay, they showing some clips of Lamar Jackson to Sammy Watkins. That is his newest veteran addition to the wide receiver group. I was like, okay, Lamar threw the pass, his completion. Sammy Watkins caught it. Okay, that's all I thought about it. But then people flipped that. Oh, the pass was so wobbly. It's a terrible pass. He can't throw the ball. He can't throw outside the numbers. And again, L Lamar Jackson, one thing about him that he will continue to do, he will bring out people's true character. I commented on uh, the Pat McAfee show. Uh, I commented on the video. And I said, we are definitely in the offseason. We're analyzing one pass from OTAs. It wasn't a big deal. I do appreciate Pat's breakdown of the roots from the trees, though. I didn't realize that. Because he talked about how it, it might have been windy out there uh, in Owings Mills, but the, the, they said the trees weren't moving. And he was talking about, well, it's close to the water and the trees with their roots, they look for water. So that's why the trees, those roots, they, they search for water and they're so deep in the ground. So that's why the trees aren't moving like that, even though it's windy. And somebody replied to that. Well, a couple of people. Shout out to Team Keep It Clean because I saw a lot of y'all came through. But somebody replied to it. And he said... Again, th this is what a lot of people do, too. When, when it comes to Lamar Jackson throwing, this is what a lot of people go to. And it's pretty, like, it's pretty weak. It's like one of the weakest, like, go-tos. You anyway, let's go to it. He said, <clears throat> watch Lamar in a throwing competition at the Pro Bowl a couple years ago. Comedy gold, just like Lamar's accuracy. So, w w you know somebody, and I just talked about how people are down bad when they overanalyzing this clip. You know somebody is really down way bad if they say, oh, look at Lamar Jackson in that Pro Bowl throwing competition, in the accuracy competition. It's like they, they said, no, don't look at his continued years of success as a starting quarterback for the Baltimore Ravens. Don't look at his unanimous MVP. Don't look at all the success that he's had ever since he came into the, don't look at that. No, 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 no. Go to that Pro Bowl competition. Go to that Pro Bowl skills competition. That's what you should go to. And it's, it's like some, a lot of people's ugly come out. I, I replied to it, though. I said, watch Lamar actually play football. It makes comments like yours comedy gold for their inaccuracy. So I had to do a little remix of what he said and go. Pshoo! Baby shots fired. Not shots fired. Just a little baby. That wasn't even nothing. So then the response was, you mean where he only threw 24 times in a playoff game last year? See, this is. Is that a bad thing? That he only threw 24 times in the playoffs. So it's like people with their arguments when it comes to Lamar Jackson. When they start, when you could tell they don't have anything valid to say, they start getting nasty. He said, Lamar is a joke. And when he is no longer the fastest player on the field, his career will come to an end. So again, a lot of people like to go to that too. They say, oh, when Lamar Jackson doesn't have any speed anymore, then it's going to be over for him. It's like pe people go for the what ifs. When it comes to Lamar Jack, they always do. You, 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 I know y'all seen it. They go for the what ifs. What if he didn't have his legs? What's going to happen when he can't run as fast? What's going to happen then? Oh, if, if Lamar takes the wrong hit, he's one hit away from his career ending. You, I know you've seen him before. I know you've seen plenty of them before too. Because I sure have. But anyway, he said, reminds me of another running quarterback coached by a Harbaugh. Except that QB actually made it to the Super Bowl. Tell you what, when Lamar actually wins the Super Bowl, then you can tell me how great and how smart he is. See, see, and this is another thing, too. When you know somebody, they just, they don't know Lamar Jackson. They don't watch Lamar Jackson. You can, this is when the media start feeding them stuff. They start listening to all of that because they talk about a lack of intellect with Lamar Jackson. And we know that couldn't be farther from the truth. If somebody, if Lamar Jackson lacked intellect, if he lacked smarts, Please tell me how, please tell me how he could even make it playing quarterback. How can you lead a team of 52 other men if you cannot, if you don't have any intellect whatsoever? How do you do that? How do you read defenses? How do you make precision passes? How do you throw people over? How do you throw it over? How do, how do you do that if... It just doesn't make any sense. But he continued. He said, until then, just shut up. That was to me. That wasn't to Lamar. That was to me. I can take it, though. He said, until then, just shut up and realize he isn't a good quarterback. 
You can't be a good quarterback in the NFL if you are always the dumbest person on the field. You see, again, people, and that's, I'm, I'm sure y'all have seen way more worse examples uh, of people like that. Well, a lot more harsh than that. But people are waiting for Lamar Jackson to slip up. They are waiting for Lamar Jackson to fail. And times like this, when clips get shown like that and people take it overboard like this, they all come out. They're waiting for stuff like that. They're waiting for it. So anyway, it's, the point to all of this, it's not a big deal. The clip was not a big deal. The wobbly pass was not a big deal. <laughs> because Lamar Jackson, hey, if he throws a wobbly pass and it goes for a touchdown, you think I'm going to be complaining? I mean, I, I have seen, I've seen people do it now. I've seen people do it. They'll be like, oh, if he, he'll throw a touchdown pass. If it wasn't the perfect pass, they'd be like, oh, man, Lamar Jackson, he threw it too far. He threw it too low. He threw it too high. He threw it behind him. Oh, man. But it'll be a touchdown. It'll be a touchdown. And I'm not saying, I'm not saying Lamar is above reproach and Lamar is above criticism or anything like that because he's not. Nobody is. But people will, they'll cherry pick for stuff. And they, they will, they'll nitpick at stuff. Just because it's Lamar Jackson. Y'all be well. Y'all have a great day. And <laughs> I don't even know what else to say, man. I'm out. I love y'all.